Who did all of this? Samson, did you do this? Did you make this mess? My name is Jennifer and today I'm gonna to do a really good deep fall clean. As you can see, the house gets dirty, dusty, things pile up, dishes are in the sink. So let's go do some cleaning.
Cleaning is so therapeutic. 
I'm getting ready to go back to my second seasonal job. I'm Christmas for the Children Program Director in my county. So in addition to teaching full-time Monday through Friday, I'll add this second job. So while I had the day off, I decided that I would do a deep fall clean. I'm gonna focus on getting everything cleaned. Um, I'm gonna clean glass, clean mirrors, clean the bathroom, the bedrooms, vacuum. I also am going to vacuum the furniture to get all of the dog hair up and the dust bunnies. So um, just come along with me and watch. And I'm also using my new Jaws water system cleaning. It's just refillable bottles and you add pods that are colorful. And um, I really love this so far, but this is actually my first full day using the products. So we'll see how these work. The kitchen table is one area that I consider to be the catch-all for us. As soon as we come in the door, we start putting things there. It's just where everything goes. I like to be able to clean off my table, make it look nice, but I'm not really sure where to put things. Since we're in a rental, we don't have a lot of cabinet space here for things such as snacks. Plus, I don't like putting snacks into the cabinet area because rats have a tendency to get in there if they get in your house and of course they will at some point or another and they will just make a mess so i use these little trays that i bought at walmart for my snacks to try to keep them a little bit more organized where do you guys keep your snacks and how do you keep your table area clutter free let me know down below in the comments. I'm open to any tips or suggestions. Um, just give me some ideas of what you do to keep this area nice and clean and clutter free.
So I think I'm at the halfway point in my cleaning. I had to stop and take a break, get some water, have some lunch. Hubby and I went to eat over the weekend, so I had some spaghetti left over, so I heated that up. Um, he's gone working today, so I'm just taking advantage of cleaning. And now I'm gonna have to take the dog out. Hello. Hi, are you ready to go out to potty? Ready to go potty? Come on, let's go, let's go potty. Yeah, let's go. Are you ready? Let's go. So, I thought I was videoing myself cleaning the sink. However, it cut off. So, the sink is already clean. So, I'm just going to keep finishing. I was using the disinfectant, the yellow bottle in the jaws to clean it. So, here we go. Let's start. This is the first time I'm using the Jaws shower cleaner, so I'm gonna see how this works. Remember in one of my last videos, I showed you how I used just a old broom that I don't sweep with to scrub my shower. I won't show that step here, so I'm just gonna spray the Jaws cleaner and let that sit a few minutes, and then I'll take my broom and scrub it down, and then we'll clean the mirrors. I also took the shower curtain and liner down, threw it in the washing machine, Put a little bleach in there to disinfect it. This is the rainbow mate that goes with the rainbow vacuum system. I'm gonna add a few drops of orange scent, add some water up to the fuel line, and then let that sit in my sunroom. It helps purify and clean the air.
For as long as I've been married, I've always used the rainbow vacuum system. My first one died, so I had to find another one, and just so happens a friend's mom had passed away, so she let me have hers for a really good deal. It takes a little bit of time to get all of this out and hook up the parts, so I use it when I'm doing a really good deep clean like I am today. The vacuum attachment is really great. It does a good thorough deep clean. It really lifts the dirt out of your carpets. And my favorite tool is the floor sweeper. I like to get it out and go over all of my floors. And it also has different attachments where you can vacuum your furniture and other things in your home. And it's a water system, so you fill it up with water and you can put some freshened drops in there, scented drops, and make your house smell good. I would really love to have one of those wireless vacuum cleaners that I see other YouTubers use. Um, it's something that you can get out really quickly if you're not doing a deep fall clean and have to get out the rainbow system. So I'm hoping maybe I'll get one for Christmas. Hint, hint. From the previous picture, I showed you um, the white cleaning vinegar that I use to clean my floors with. I learned this tip a few years ago when I was the home repair director and uh, we purchased some flooring for the kitchen dining room area and the guy there said if you'll use just vinegar and water to clean your floors, it won't leave that soapy residue on top of them and after trying this a few times i discovered that it works wonders it does not leave a filmy residue on your floors and it makes them shiny as you will see when my floors dry and a lot of people don't like the vinegar smell but after a little bit you can't tell that it smells like vinegar especially if you're burning candles or using some type of air cleaning system but um, it works really great and makes your floors look beautiful.
Don't forget to like and subscribe my channel so you'll receive notifications for all the new content I post.